Hello, and welcome to CCIEadvisor.com. In this lesson, we'll be discussing the show VLAN command. It's a simple command, but it's very necessary in configuring your switches. So, let's go ahead and begin. Here we are, we're ready to uh, type it. Show VLAN for virtual LAN. You can also abbreviate this as sh SH V L. SHVL is enough so that the Cisco uh, switch will understand. The iOS can always understand the command as long as it's the longest amount of letters that is specific only to that command. So there's no other command that starts off with SH, although there are other commands that start off with S. So the abbreviation of S would never work for show, but SH does. And there are other commands that start off with, other show commands that start off with V. So the letter V was not enough. So in this case, show VLAN can be truncated to its minimum point would be SH space VL. So we've typed that and we've hit the enter key. And you have a lot of output here and we don't always use all of it. But uh, as you can see here, the VLAN and the VLAN numbers. Now these VLANs right here, they, they come right out of the box pre-configured and they have to do with FIDI and token ring and things like that and personally I never use them. But they're there permanently, there's as far as I know no way to get rid of them. And also VLAN 1, the infamous VLAN 1 is the default VLAN its name is default but that also is the function it's at the default VLAN it's also active on every port right out of the box now this um, this switch has 48 fast ethernet ports and 2 gigabit ports <clears throat> as well and if you remember from one of our previous lessons we did create a VLAN 10 and this is what we called it and so we're just keeping this configuration for example you can see that we've applied it in one of our other lessons to fast ethernet 3 and it shows up here as active also here um, type enet for ethernet FIDI token ring etc the um, SAID <coughs> if you see a trend here <coughs> Excuse me. This number with the one appended, the 10, it's basically 100,000 with the VLAN added to it. And this will be the VLAN ID, the SAID, 1002. So it's 101,002. So you get it. If I were to type and create a VLAN, 111, then it would be one, the SAID for that would be 100111. The MTU, you can see here is 1500. You can change that. That's um, configurable. Um, for most catalyst switches, the MTU is only um, configurable on the switch as a whole. Um, you can do uh, jumbo frames and things like that, but usually uh, you have to do that on the the entire switch. Um, the spanning tree is IBM for this. The um, TRNet default and IEEE for the FIDI net. I hit the enter key a couple times or you can hit space. 
um, we are not spanning any VLANs. That'll be another lesson. I'll do that, and then we'll come back, come back by, and see what that looks like. So, thank you for watching the show VLAN, and this concludes this lesson at CCIEadvisor.com. Thank you.